Hey guys, this is the fifth video today. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. One, two, three, four, five. This is the fifth video within the last 30 or 40 minutes. And guess what? I got more. I committed to doing a marathon today and I'm posting all of them. A marathon to give you guys quick, quick nuggets on how to end your 2019, how to go into 2020, how to just set you up for success, how to just give you more information than you, you uh, uh, may need at the moment if you haven't started your business, how to set you up for success when you start your business. I'm just running over this morning, right? So I'm super excited. This is Coach Michelle, Michelle Williams, Coach Rob in the building, and we are coming to you live, 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 wanting you to have the best 2020 possible so what i want you guys to do is go through 2019 literally look through 20 2019 and figure out all the things that you did right and also the things that you did wrong and come up with a nice plan going into 2020 right so you look at what you did and you say okay i did this 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 or i networked with this place this place or i built a strategic relationship with this place this place this place this gave me this amount of leads clients that came from those leads and the revenue that came from those leads right so you want to make sure because this is something that people do they have success and then they get away from it. Let me say that again. Come close. They have success and then they get away from it. Meaning they just keep trying new things. Guys, don't reinvent the wheel. If you work with this type of facility and have success, duplicate it. Do the same thing at other facilities. Don't start saying, oh, I got to do this. I got to do this. I heard coach say this. I heard this other coach say this. I heard this person say this. My friend is doing this. Guys, look at your records. Look at, because everybody should know where their referrals are coming from and where the money is coming from, right? And then you look at it and you say, okay, this was a big hit. This was a 10. This was a zero. This was a one. Right. And then if you have something like a five, then maybe you could continue to do that, but you may not do it as often. Right. But if you have something that's generating a lot of leads, you want to keep doing that. So say if you're working with a hospital and you did a lunch and learn and or you did a vendor event, whatever it is you did and you got a lot of leads or you built a lot of relationships that are sending you referrals, leads, then duplicate that. Go to the next hospital, go to the next hospital, go to the next hospital. Because obviously you said something that resonated with them and you spoke their language. And if you say, coach, what do you mean spoke their language? Look at a video I did about three videos ago. And I specifically gave a quick nugget on speaking someone's language, right? In the business industry. So it's very, very important, guys, to make sure you duplicate, 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 duplicate. And that will generate more success in your business. That will generate, AKA, more revenue coming into your business. Stop trying to reinvent the wheel. The wheel rolls fine. The, the wheel is working fine. Stop trying to reinvent it. Do what you have done that created success for you. So look at your records, jot it down, and, and, and figure it out. And then after you do that and you realize, okay, it's coming from this type of place, this type of place, I want you to go on the internet, Google University. I want you to go on the internet and find more places, businesses, people like that one or those and contact them. Set up your marketing plan. So you want to have a marketing plan going into 2020. Set up your marketing plan and do the same thing, guys. Do the same thing. Do the same thing. Think about Tony Robbins. Right? If you've ever been to a Tony Robbins event, I haven't, but I just know, right? Because I do events, right? Go to the view or anything. You can think of so many different examples. But when they go, uh, uh, when they're on a tour and they go from this place, this place, this place, this place, or think about an entertainer, Beyonce. You see Beyonce here, here, here. She's on tour. It's the same songs. It's the same songs, right? So they're performing. So they have a list that they go through. Maybe they may do one song different, but it's a system. It's a system. It's a system. And if you guys follow me, um, we did, Coach Rob and I, we did a video uh, last week on systems, 
right? Systems. And then we do a lot inside of our HCP tribe. And it may have been a video in there. I'm not really sure. If you don't know what the HCP tribe is, go to my home care coach, myhomecarecoach.com, myhomecarecoach.com, and you can find out more about the HCP tribe. Guys, it's so, so important to duplicate your success. Duplicate your success. That's one of the reasons why people fail in business because they keep trying new things. Now, let me say this. So you've found something that worked and, you've, and you're duplicating it. Now, I do believe in trying something new once you already max that out. So now you try something else because you want multiple streams of referrals coming in. So I'm not saying, okay, you went to a hospital now, you done exhausted the five hospitals in your area and you're done. No, you're done with that and you're going to continue to nurture those relationships. But now you may go to an assisted living. May, now you may go to this place, this place, and then you want to start figuring out how to master that relationship and then you duplicate. And that's how you start to really grow your business, guys. So again, this is Coach Michelle coming to you live from Atlanta. Subscribe, like, comment, and I will see you on the next video. Congratulations, congratulations, congratulations on your success in 2020. Take care. God bless.